Good morning, guys and traders uh, from United World Capital and Cyprus, where we are going into a new trading week. Oil prices are skyrocketing this morning due to the threats that now uh, ESOC, which is the new challenge uh, the Mexican Gulf uh, is confronted with in the form of a storm which is also now threatening oil installations in the area. Brent crude is uh, jumping uh, above one $115 a barrel this morning, and also New York crude is following up with 97. The uh, markets in Asia are very volatile this morning, going in between positive and negative territory. Uh, while the uh, stock exchanges in New York uh, ended uh, in positive ter territory last night, based on new possible signals coming from Mr. Bernanke and the Federal Reserve. This week, the concentration is for sure going to be uh, around the meeting in the Federal Reserve uh, at the end of the week on the 31st of August. The markets are expected some uh, good news in the form of indications that the Federal Reserve would take new steps for what they called quantitative easing. The uh, verdict on that uh, is uh, up uh, for speculation for the time being. It's not quite clear what the Federal Reserve would decide. And also, we are now starting to come very close to the presidential elections. And the Federal Reserve would not be accused by the Republicans for then taking uh, economic stimulus, which would mean a boost to Mr. Obama prior to the elections. The gold prices are continuing up this morning, uh, reaching uh, 1675, and also silver prices are at its highest levels for several weeks. In Euro, uh, in the Euro area, Mr. Samaras has uh, ended his charm offensive to Berlin and Paris. When he came back to Greece on Sunday, he made a press conference saying that uh, Greece is going to stay in the euro, and uh, he also warned against speculations to the contrary. Mrs. Angela Merkel gave him support in the sense that she also on Sunday came with a warning to some of her compatriots, which have been taking then a Greek exit from the Eurozone as uh, a, a matter of fact. She said that, watch your words very carefully, uh, ladies and gentlemen, with regards to talking about a Greek, possible Greek exit. The currency markets are uh, rather stable this morning with the Euro trading on 125.05. That is down from the high levels uh, seen last week, where we had something of a rally in the euro. I think that that would be difficult to follow up during this week, and I expect to see bigger volatility and uh, downward press on the euro during this week. I wish all of you a very good trading day and best regards and wishes from United World Capital and Cyprus.